Oh, man. There he is. Luke just took into a jungle, I'm pretty sure. If it ain't big, something's wrong. Oh my god. I'm moving it. Ouch. Look at that tomcat rod, just getting a workout today. That's a medium heavy. It's got custom north on it. It's big. Unbelievable. That is a fight. You get a big fish like this, it's important. You don't want to tie them up too much. Huh? The best interest for the fish is health, thank you. You, you chase them down. Oh yeah, that's big. That's a jungle. And just doubled over, doubled up, doubled over. Um, I'm gonna get ready for the net. Oh my God, Luke. Oh, oh it's huge. God. It's a hundred pounder maybe. I don't know if that can, oh, the hook just came out. Did it? No, I don't know. Oh.
We gotta was, get it in, get it in. I'm I was kinda more. down in the dumps and this, I, I've never seen a fish, a catfish this big, that's for sure. This is the biggest thing I've ever seen. I'm gonna start the motor. I just wanna get out in the current here. Yeah, you can try. Make sure you're grabbing the knot. I got it. All right, we, we cannot move this boat without getting oh. this fish in. This is just a complete giant. Uh. Oh my God, folks. Check out uh. this Northwoods angling, boys. Uh. <laughs> oh. oh my God. <laughs> yes, yes. Heartbeat? Oh, it's just racing. Yeah, what, 180, 190? I don't even know what they are, but holy shnikes. <sighs> um, can we motor back up to the, or should we, yeah, we gotta yeah, go Let anchor. me race up there. We gotta tie up to that anchor. All right. We yeah. got, I don't know, 140 pounds of fish in the boat right yeah. now. That might be 100 plus. I don't know how big that is. Oh, watch that rod. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> it doesn't even look real. No. No. <laughs> Not even close. Get that unhooked. I don't even know where to begin. Get it unhooked, get the rod out of the way. Oh my you God. You make it sound like it's easy to get it unhooked. Oh, it's so big. Flyers. <clears throat> All right. You gotta grab by the mouth, I'll grab the tail. Okay. My hand. Good? Yeah. <laughs> Look at my comparison. It's a daddy fish and a, it's a mama and fish. A mini fish. <gasps> All right, Luke, we got to get these fish back. Let's do it. Let's release them. I think we're going to call this trip a done deal. We're yep. going to probably pack up, yep. <laughs> head home. This is what we, we needed oh. at the end. From Northwoods Angling, Luke and I, everybody. You gotta get down to the Missouri River. We'll this is phenomenal. We'll see you next one. We'll see you on the next one. All right. Ow! <sighs> Mine was ready. Well, it's 41 and a half. That's 55 by 41 and a half. That's ridiculous. Let's get this fish back. Yep. Can you do this on your own? Uh, ready? What do you got? 55 by 41 and a half blue. That's gotta be a hundred pounder, dude. Yep. Gotta be. Talk it up, brother. Oh, he's biting down on my hand. There he goes. Oh, you guys, insane. I don't, I don't know what to tell you guys, but that was insane. I think the shirt says it all, brother. Got me out. I'm shaking, I've got the chills. My chest hurts from hanging over the boat. My hands are completely bloody. I don't know, you guys, I was humming off. We gotta get one of these, brother. <laughs> it's just a great fish. Yeah. It's about all the drag we got on that river. Like I only have about 12 pounds of drag, which I normally don't run. Very much drag, but in this current, we really don't have a choice. My goodness, what a fish. Uh oh, there you go. There's the bubbles. Alright, uh, he's going back down now, isn't he? That's your 80. That's your 80 pound fish, Landon. Yes, it is, too. You got my chair. You got my chair.
I'm gonna have like an anxiety attack or something. Just not knowing how he's hooked, killing me. Like, if I can see he's hooked good, I'll be fine. There he goes again. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna let, I'm gonna let a little bit of anchor rope out. Now you make sure you keep it tight, okay? You're not gonna completely undo this, but just don't. Just make sure you gain some ground, but keep it tight. Whatever you do, keep it tight. Try to get him up to the surface, and we'll just try to net him right now. All right, come on, let's make a count. Come on. Oh, he's about there, isn't he? Come on, come on, come on. Nope. Oh, God. How big is that one, Landon? I don't know how I'm gonna weigh it. I need I need Mike here to weigh it for me. Check out this Check out the mouth. So we just caught a 46, and this it literally looks double the size, doesn't it? What? It looks double the size of that one we just caught. Six. I ate all tackling cats and nailed him. Not a very big hook, but big enough to catch whatever this is. <laughs> this is gonna be the biggest fish that we've ever caught right here. All right, tell me what you see, because I'm not going to be able to look at it from where I'm at. Oh, my, it's a 90. 90? 99. No. 89. It said 99? Yeah, I couldn't really tell. It was going pretty fast. I got to take a break. I'll try one more time here. 88, 88, 89, 89, 88, 88, 89. All right, I'm good with that. I don't even know if I can pick this thing up. So we're gonna put a scratch in the floor right here, guys. I got his tail against that back there. All right, I got that marking. I don't call fish or we, you caught a fish that I can't pick up. Take some pictures. Get this guy back in. Oh, here we go. Oh, I love it. He's ready to go. There he goes, back healthy. We try to make sure we got him back in as quick as possible. Got a quick wait and a couple pictures, but around here where we're at, there's not many of those. So when you catch one, you gotta take good care of it. I don't even know what to say right now, guys. I'm just gonna have to catch my breath and calm down. I knew when that rod went down that it was something serious. I knew it had to be. It, it was the slowest takedown ever. It, oh my gosh. I'll get back with y'all in a minute after I catch my breath. So the bait we were using was cut buffalo. Find any fish on the side, Anchored up. Here we go. That's a good fish. That is a good fish. Oh, he's got it. Oh, he's got it. Oh, he's got My goodness. Oh. Good night. That backbone stops that second eye. This is a giant. I mean a giant. That's exactly what we saw on that side image. If you notice on our rods, when that fish took it down, most rods are about that big. 
those rods you're used to using that fit in the rod holder, you try to yank them out of the rod holder and they already fill the rod holder up, you can't even get the rod holder down with all the torque. We purposely made the back end of our butts narrower than the rest of the, the handle. And the reason for that is just for pulling that fish out, pulling that rod out of the rod holder with that fish on it. Guys, I'm sorry if I can't talk because let me tell you, this is what <laughs> Big Cat Fever is all about. Do you need some help? One, two, three. This is what Big Cat Fever is all about right there. I'm going to take the hook out. And we're going to show you mean to stop it? these people what we just landed here. Oh. Oh. Big cat fever rods. Make sure they're in your boat. And you'll be sure to land some fish just like this one. I'm gonna do my best to weigh this fish. Ready? Hold, hold him, hold him, hold him. Oh my God, it topped out at 111. Okay, okay. I'm done, I can't do no more. All right, catchthefever.com, baby. Get you some big cat fever rods. <laughs> Woo! Oh, that right. I'm pretty good. He's poking right over. He did it. Now he's supposed to be. Trying to, trying to figure it out. We've been running out of camera, battery on the big camera. We've got the handy camera out. Last spot of the day. He's got a good tail shape. We didn't really figure out what's going on. Oh, God. Oh, God. Whoa. He just didn't. He, that's a big fish, boys. <laughs> Whoa. Get over here, you old Wilson pig. Oh, come on. Get that fish right. Get, you gotta get him closer. I'm getting it. Wow. <laughs> Holy moly. And that's why you fish a little longer. Wow. Look at this toad. <laughs> right there, buddy. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Holy crap. That's a big one, bud. Uh, and you know what? I'm sitting there milking that fish like it's about a 30 pounder. <laughs> he just came out of that deep water. And... You know, anytime you could go out and fish and with the expectation of catching a really big fish, regardless of whatever you're fishing for, but then actually doing it. And, you know, I, all I did was just reel it in. Ryan was the one that, that did all the work. He found the spots and he, he cut bait. I mean, he just treats me and everybody else, treat us all the same to where they work nonstop to make sure that the fishing experience for everybody is, you know, the best it could possibly be. And this was just supposed to be a relaxing trip. We were gonna go out, we were just gonna have some fun, shoot a little video, but he goes straight to work, 100% committed or whatever else. And that's what it had to be. And you know what? Because of that commitment and because of that dedication, look what we got. I mean, very few people have caught a catfish that size, and even fewer have actually got it documented. Like we, from the takedown to bringing it in to holding this thing. And let me tell you something: it was heavy. Crap! That's a fish, buddy. That's a dandy right there, now, boys. I, I mean, that is a big fish. I hope y'all can hear us, but that is a dandy. I mean, that is a freaking, that's a fish. I don't know if I can, I'm about to lose my balance. <laughs> Boys, let me tell you something. This is why you come to Alabama. Wilson Lake, that's a dandy. That's my biggest catfish I've ever caught and I am worn out. <laughs> wow, what a fish, what a fish fish right here. I got to put him down. I can't hold him. 
you never know, you'll never catch that fish of a lifetime unless you go. And so we were out there, we gave it the good old college try. Yeah, it had an east wind. We could come up with every scenario known to man as where it's bad luck to fishing. But it's cold, everything else. But this guy still <coughs> put us on fish and gave us this opportunity. And hey, I caught probably a hundred pound catfish. Probably. We didn't have a scale, guys. Maybe, could be, <laughs> you tell us how big you think that fish was. Can Record. I just throw it in? <laughs> I can't lay it down. <laughs> All right, buddy, let's get him back. Let's go head first. You going this way, though? There you go. I can't that's, believe how tired I am. That's a dandy, buddy. This fish is just so big. This is a huge fish. But oh, we gotta let her go. You can hold the mouth with your left hand. That'd hey, be I'm gonna put this fish in. You better get what you can get. Cause I want her back in the water. She, I got she has earned her. She's earned it. There you go. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. I'm telling you. You know what this is? Stick a fork in.